What's up guys, Die Gaming here, and today we're going to be learning the DT Cannon, also known as the Double Triple Cannon. It is an opener or mid-game technique that allows you to send a double T-spin or a tri and, sorry, and a triple T-spin. Um, the DT Cannon, you want to use it whenever you have an early L and S or an early J and S. And pretty much this lets you set up um, a certain shape that is needed. And this shape looks like this. Um, and this allows you to set up two T-spins in a row, right? So the first one spins into this, and that's a double, and then you go for a triple. And then afterwards, you're actually left with a perfect uh, four wide technique. So you can actually go for a four wide, which is another uh, opener that people use and basically it allows you to you know combo tons of lines into each other so that's pretty cool but yeah and that's pretty much it for the DT cannon there is another setup for it what you just saw was the LS and the reason we always want to do our DT cannons on the left side is because you can basically hard drop the LS and T which is pretty insane uh, it lets you build the DT cannons really quickly so the other version, instead of using LST, is you can actually go for a J and uh, Z here. And, you know, this is obviously less recommended because, you know, you're missing out on the instant hard drop that you can get with the other setup. But it still works, you know. Um, and I, I checkmated myself by doing some weird stuff. Uh, oops. But, <laughs> but you know, if you don't mess up and create eye dependencies like I did, uh, you'd be fine with this, this setup. It'd be the same idea, right? You, you'd have this, uh, pretend that there are no errors. I mean, this would still work uh, since I only have a hold there. So my double triple won't be affected. It's just unfortunate that it kind of ended up like this because you see, this would be the double and this would be the triple and so i mean i'd still be fine i'd still get the double triple but you know it would uh hurt me in the future uh now i'm going to give the mic over to die analytics to tell you a little bit more about how this hits your opponent thank you mr gaming i'll take it from here so there are two different attack types that we can do with the det cannon the first way is you know, doing a T-spin double immediately followed by a T-spin triple. The second way is to do the T-spin double early, uh, continue placing lines, and then do the T-spin triple. So, the first method uh, is a T-spin double into a T-spin triple. So the T-spin double, as you can see, sends four lines, but the T-spin triple becomes a back-to-back -back T spin triple, which means that it sends eight lines, giving you a total of a whopping 12 lines. Now, the other way is if we send in a T spin double and then a T spin triple. So that would just be, of course, four for the double and six for the triple uh, because you're breaking your back to back combo. And of course, you're asking yourself, why would I ever do that? And it's because you have to, to build down just in case your opponent sends you a little too many lines and you need to counter. And that's all I've got. Uh, back to you, Die Gaming. Thanks for that, Dai. Um, now we're gonna show off the DT Cannon in the Tetra League. Hopefully we get good bags for it. If not, I'm probably going to lose my rank. <laughs> um, and yeah, I mean, I'll see you when we get there. Ah, oh, crap. I'm chewing on a gummy, guys. I didn't think I'd get a game this soon. Alright, we're against TE and um, they've got a 107. Uh, yeah, here's the here's the DT cannon in action. Um, we're looking at that. Alright, we got a pretty good bag for it. We saved the T. We're going to put the square on the left. and then, Oh, we got a pretty bad bag for it is what I meant to say. Because this came first and this is like not good for us. So, we're just going to... I don't know. I don't know what we're gonna do. I'll, I'll see you in the next one, I guess. So we so we got KO'd. <laughs> um, all right, but now it's 
that's also a bad bag for it, but maybe we can make it work. I accidentally did that. All right, well, now we can... <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, no. <sighs> okay, it's, a, it's an all right opening. I messed up! Oh, man, guys. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I threw. Uh, oh, he got it all clear. Well, uh, hopefully I went out here so uh, we can uh, continue our conquest of the great beyond together as a unit or something like that. So uh, we might have lost the uh, third game here, but now we can DT cannon. Yes. Okay. 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 All right, here's the DT cannon. Um, basically, we're going to want to build up like this. Great, we got it. So now, we're going to... Oh my god, he went for an all clear. All right, now it's fine. Now we hit him with this. And pretty much that'll send him a lot of lines to start with. Uh, and then we just got a clean up shop afterwards. Yeah, nice. So, we went out the second game. Pretty good. Uh, that was the DT cannon. And... Um, yeah, I mean, let's, I mean, we can do it again, uh, probably, and as you can see, what I was talking about before, you can just triple drop that, um, which is why, uh, this time around, we're doing pretty well, so we're gonna actually go for the double into the triple, and as you can see, that sent a ton of lines to him, and then after that, we can kind of just, uh, you know, just try to, uh, clean up shop with another T-spin, knock him out. Alright, nice, we got him again, um... Yeah, so the DT Cannon's really killing it right now against this guy. Oh, that's a perfect setup. As you, as you can see, very early, perfect triple drop kind of setup. Um, that's sick for us. That's really great. Uh, but now we got to... Uh, oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. This all clear is going to hurt a lot. Uh, here's the double. We need to get the other T, but we can't. So we actually have to ruin our DT Cannon setup. That is a worry about the DT, right? If you can't do it fast enough, you know, and he hits you with a lot of lines at the beginning. Uh, I mean, that's probably a, that's a, that's a me problem. Uh, I'm sure if you guys grinded out this opening a little more than I did, uh, you would probably be able to do this a lot faster than me. Uh, but you know, I, I didn't I didn't I didn't put all the hours in, you know. Uh, so it's just it's just worse for me. You know, when you guys do it, it might not be this way. Uh, but it's okay. We're gonna go again for a back-to-back -back one. That's four. That's gonna be a lot of lines sent. Uh, yeah. Nice. So, we went out. Um, that's the next game. Hopefully, we can win this match with the DT. Um, yeah, I mean, I think we should try running it anyway. Uh, despite this not being, like, the most ideal setup. Because we can just pull things off. Oh god, it's another all clear. Uh, starting to regret my decisions here. Yeah, let's just ruin it. Uh, I don't think it's gonna work out very well for us if we stay in the DT. Uh, that's so sad, guys. That's so sad. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Dang it. It wasn't even worth it. <laughs> Alright, now it's the tiebreaker. Hopefully, we can get the DT off before he gets a... Uh, perfect clear, but it looks like we're not gonna have an- Oh, we did get it! We actually clutched out a, uh, early, uh, what's it called piece? Oh no, this is not good, actually. Uh-oh. Uh... Oh, wait, wait, wait! Cancel that, cancel that. Uh, do this first. Oh, Jesus! My board! My board looks disgusting right now! Oh, I'm just cringing looking at this board, man. Uh, oh no, oh! God. Oh lord. No, it wasn't worth it. It wasn't worth it. Oh no. All right, we lost. GG. Um happens. Hopefully we don't D rank to A+. Plus. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. I'll I'll bring it back. I'll play some ranked games. We'll bring it back to S minus. Oopsies. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys found this insightful. If not, please let me know what I should cover next. Um, learning these openings has been really fun for me, so don't hold anything back. Oh, also, please, please, please don't forget to like and subscribe. It's free, and it shows me that you're enjoying what you see. <laughs> um, other than that, I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace!